For sure, Kaiju and Cryptids is a fan-made Godzilla parody series, and despite the occasional references, has no connection to Toho, Dai, or Legendary, for it exists in its own universe. The show is for those who are age 12 and up. There we go, that's all the garbage taken care of. All ready for the garbage man, yay! Hey there, Horace! Oh look everyone, it's Flare Man! What the hell do you want, Flare Man? I'm just here to let you know that the garbage men were here this morning and they won't be back until next week. What the hell are you banging on about, Flare Man? Wait, you're absolutely right. I've just realized the garbage man will be back until next week. <laughs> wow, what a twist. I can't say that I saw that coming. Look, who are the directors of this show? I don't know, but I gotta say that they have a good taste. Hey, shut up, all of you. The next show's about to start. Welcome back to Space Godzilla's Monster Stargate. Our first guest of today claims to have made an amazing discovery, and he has an announcement to make on it. Please help me to welcome the Warriors Kaiju, Maguma. Welcome to the show, my friend, and how are you feeling today? I'm doing good, thanks. And I believe that there is something that you wish to tell us all. Is that true? Yes, I do. Kaiju and Cryptids of Monster Island, I'm here to educate you all on what will be the greatest threat to our planet. You see, there is something out there that threatens our very existence and may end all life on Earth as we know it. I am talking, of course, about Calamity Death Star Gorath. Death Star Gorath? It is a rogue planet of unknown origins that is six times bigger than the Earth that will pull anything into its orbit and then kaboom! That object will be no more. It doesn't have to directly hit us, but it will pull the planet towards itself. And if it gets too close to the Earth, then all hell will break loose, as it will cause all sorts of natural disasters that all go off at the same time. Volcanoes, earthquakes, landslides, tsunamis, hurricanes, tornadoes, etc. and so on, you name it. Gorath will cause it all. However, it only gets worse as Gorath will be powerful enough to suck the Earth's atmosphere out. Gravity will die. Every molecule, atom, drop of water, buildings, plants, and even mountains will be pulled into the Earth's orbit. Nothing will survive it. Not even us kaiju or even cryptids. This final picture is the most terrifying, as it shows the aftermath of Gorath's approach. For Bear Canyon, with the huge crack, is the Pacific Ocean, without the water in it, and as for the dead hills in the background that you see, that is none other than our beloved home, Master Island. That's what lies ahead of us. I am super duper seal. Dugon. But have no fear, because I, Maguma, will gather the world's strongest monsters to go into outer space and destroy Gorath once and for all, and everybody will say, thank you Maguma, you are a hero, and you're super awesome. Do gone. The end. Um, okay. That was interesting. Very interesting indeed. Um, uh, thank you for your time, Maguma. My pleasure, Spaceman. I'm off to McDonald's now. Their burgers are super seal. Do gone. Coming up next, I interview a kaiju who was born on another planet right after the commercial break. What the hell is that Wars character banning on about? I've never heard of a rogue planet. I didn't know you could get them. I think somebody's been watching too many disaster movies. <laughs> Oink. Oink. Stupid as usual, I see, pig face. Oh, guys, guess what? I have got this. Oink. It's my birthday on the 27th, you guys. Oink. I'm gonna be 12 years old. Oink. I'm gonna be a big boy. Oink. And because you guys are my best friends. Oink. You're all invited! Oink! Here you go, Duran! Oink! Here you are, Zilla! Oink! Compare me to that useless iguana for cousin of mine again! I shall destroy you! Here you are, Nessie, my best friend in the whole wide world! Oink! And here you go, Anguinus! Oink! Uh, actually, it's Anguirus. <gasps> I knew you guys would say yes! 
Oink. You sure are the best friends any pig can ever ask for. Oink. We're gonna have so much fun together. Oink. It's gonna be a real party. Oink. My very own monster chumps. Oink. Look, I don't know why we have to go to Pigface's 47th birthday, especially after all the crap that he's done over the years. I know what you mean, Essie, but he's still a friend at the end of the day, even though he can't say your name correctly. Not many folks can say my name right. Some pronounce my name is Anguinus, or Angoras, or Angiris, or Angulus. You understand where I'm coming from? True, true. Do you remember when he blew up the Monster Island bar back in 2015? I was on vacation at the time, but yes, I do remember that incident. Godzilla told me all about it when I returned. Look, would you look up there, laddie? There's some orange flying jack-o'-lantern things. I think those are Chinese fire lanterns. Correct, they are Chinese fire lanterns. Look, oh look, it's that insane warus from the space show. Did you get my message on Gorath? Oh yes, we heard all the details. Good, well I'm glad you did. Because Gorath is a very sealed manatee, as it destroyed my homeworld. Dugon. Look, what the bloody hell are you banging on about, lad? You're as much as an earthling as us. No, I was created on another planet, very similar to this one, but completely different. Everything was super until Gorath came and destroyed all life on my homeworld. And only me and a friend of mine, as well as an old enemy, are the only survivors. I am Super Seal, Dugon. Now I wish you both a very good night, Dugon. Do you have any idea what he was on about? Oh, I don't know, but you do know never to talk to mammals, right? Yes, that's what my cousin Kips tells me. So, uh, what were we talking about earlier? I think we were discussing a boot pig face. Oh yes, that's right. Um, I don't know, maybe we should attend his birthday. Look, he can be really irritating at times. gonna gather all the world's strongest monsters together. You're all gonna go out of space and stop Gorath from destroying the world once and for all. <sighs> Look, I've got a city to smash tomorrow, and I can really do with some shit I so please just leave me alone. Oh, I get it. You don't believe me either. I'm trying to warn everyone, nobody's taking me seal! Oh, dear God! <laughs> I just want somebody to take me still just this once! Oh, dear God! Oh, no, uh, don't cry, Magma. I believe you. No, you don't. No, I truly do believe you. It's just that this Gorath sounds like a big deal. And I'm just scared there's nothing I can do to prevent it. And when I get scared, I choose to deny it. Are you still? Yes, yes, I'm Seal. Don't worry, we can't stop it. So he phone called you during the middle of the night and went on and on about this Gorath thing? That's right, he did. Look, aren't you listening to him? Look, he got upset over the phone. No doubt he probably went old crocodile tears on you. And you're the simply a reason why nobody talks about that big Warris. And that's because... Oh good, you all made it to the rendezvous point. I thought you weren't going to make it, Dugon. But now it's time to get Seal. Okay, so you've been calling everybody all night. So where is this mythical Gorath? Gorath is not mythical, it's all real, I'm dead Seal! Dugon, look, look, I've brought my trusty telescope. Just look through it. Uh, why do you want me to look through it? Because you're my new best friend, Dugon. Okay then, even though I hardly know you. Well, 
I don't see anything. Move to your left. Oh, okay. I see some kind of star. Yes, you're looking at the right location. Sank star to the right and straight until morning. There's Gorath. Dugon. What? Look, let me have a look at that. You silly fuck. That's Neverland. Wait, what? Yeah, he's pointing the right direction. Are you trying to make us blow up our childhoods? You are one messed up character. You mean, that's not Gorath? No, all I saw was that magical floating island in the sky. Damn, for a minute there, I thought we had it. Well, in that case, it must still be in hyperspace. How far away is hyperspace? About a gazillion light years away from the solar system. Are you kidding me? Nobody can ever travel that far. Hey, true lad. I mean, don't get me wrong. There are some monsters that can live in outer space. I.e. Gigan and Space Godzilla, to name a few examples. But I highly doubt that any kaiju or even cryptid has ever travelled as far as hyperspace. Don't forget to PM my party, you guys! Oi! See you again! Oi! Okay, Ruin. Cool Dugon. Well, it took a lot of persuading, but I think I'm safe to say that I have chosen the right selection of monsters to be the world's heroes. I don't believe this! Oh, don't believe what lasts. Pigface has invited you all from the goodness of his heart to his birthday, and yet you're all running away. We're not running away, mate. We're going on an adventure into outer space. Yeah, we won't be gone long. Yeah, we'll only be quick, then we'll be back before you know it. I expect a better from you both, Farn and Angiris. Going on adventures is fine, but you can do that any time. Pigface has been inviting all of you to his birthday, and you're all ditching him for some wild goose chase. Well, excuse me, Mafra. Yeah, whatever. Man, I'm so glad that she's gone, because she was this close to interrupting the entire mission. Hey, right, wait a minute. Where's the driller man? If you mean Megalon, he ain't coming. Hey, the poor lad's totally screwed over right now. Especially after we took him to see Winnie the Pooh blood and honey. Let go, Pooh. I promise I'll save you forever. Just take me instead, please! You left. No! No! Why, Pooh? Why would you do this? Why? <laughs> My childhood is ruined. Well, we need another trooper. This is a dangerous mission. I'm seal. Dugon. Okay, 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 lad. Calm down, calm down. I'll go and get us another one. Look, Sasquatch! Sasquatch! Uh, Mercy, is that you? Look, get in the magic portal now, Sasquatch! Get in the magic portal now! Well, why do you want me, Nessie? I was having a little Sasquatch sleep. Get in the magic portal now, Sasquatch! Before I blow your goddamn brains out! Hey, I don't want to go on the adventures with you, Nessie! I'm always dangerous and suicidal, always leave me to death! Oh, quit being a pussy primate, Sasquatch! Now for the last time! Get in the magic portal now! Or I'll feed your family to the fucking sharks. Leave my homie alone, you! He doesn't want to go on any adventures! I'll call the Angus, I'll call the Angus, I'll call the Angus! You never have a choice, Sasquatch! Not go to the magic portal! Okay. Where am I? Where have you taken me, Nessie? Fuck, Sasquatch, may I welcome you to Monster Island? I thought Loch like Ness was your home. Fuck, used to be, but I don't live there anymore. You're a long way from home, my friend. And who might you be? Oh, Jesus Christ, everybody knows me. Well, I'm... This is not the time for introductions. We've got a mission to accomplish up sail, Dugon. Look, I need to show you all to your ship. Look, what the hell is that thing? That's the spaceship we'll be going on up sail. That, that thing is designed to destroy a Death Star? No, but the nuclear engine inside will. But now isn't the time to get on to the base. You all need to go inside right now, Dugon. Why the hell do we have to be lying flat on the ground? This is so embarrassing. Because if you guys stand up during the launch, the person will crush your boards. I'm seal. Do God. Right, I'm gonna start counting down now. So here we go. Eight. Six. That can't be one, good if he's counting all over. Five. Hey, what's that two, strange noise? Seven. No, that's my own heart beating. Nine. Look, do you be real, man? You be fine. Megagodzilla's the only one out of all of us who is one, lucky. 
Because it's a robot. Nine. Ha ha ha. Three. Sucks to be you. Ha ha ha. Blast off. You gone. Wait, what? There they go. Our brave heroes. Do God. Thank God we can stand up again. I hate being on my belly. It was so undignified. Yeah, tell me about it. I'm surprised you were still able to feel a thing. Especially with that huge buzzsaw of yours, Gigan. Well, let me tell you, Godzilla. My buzzsaw is hypersensitive. And one touch or false move will start off. In fact, it's so hypersensitive that the mothers won't let me deliver the newborn babies. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. I can't believe they're in outer space, mate. Yes, I'm amazed myself. Although it's not the first time, I was in outer space back in 1965. One had to help Godzilla on taking down Monster Zero. But that turned out to be none other than King Ghidorah himself. Yes, I remember. By the way, how's the horse doing? He's fine, taking a nap in the knife room. Why do we have a knife room on a rocket ship? In case of space pirates. Space pirates? Don't forget space clowns. Orc and space porky men. Oh, fuck me. I brought some free candy with me. Well, that's good, but what are you going to do when it runs out? Don't you worry about that, Gorosaurus. I've got it all planned out. <laughs> Well, since hyperspace is a gazillion light years away, I guess we'll have to do something to pass the time. Yeah, find a way to entertain ourselves. It's all the old can't up on me. All the guys they all want to be Rudolph. And in the end, I had to help Barragon with the Christmas tree. For Rodan. However, as soon as Gauss crashed into that tree and it fell on top of Barragon, I decided right there and there that I should be a doctor. Yeah, I remember that instant. That was back in 1991. Yeah, and you're a great doctor. Am I, though? Sometimes I succeed, and other times, I don't. Why, I remember back a few years ago, in 2016, Mechagodzilla self-destructed and killed King Ghidorah, and I had to revive both of them as one cyborg, Mecha King Ghidorah. So I can be a good doctor. Yes, I remember that, too. Feels like yesterday, since you had that adventure. Yes, yeah, true. The funny thing is, is that I actually don't remember it happening at all. But you should say that, because neither do I. Nor any of us. Back about the space monsters. Back about the space monsters. Go ahead, please. Yes, this is the captain of the mission here. What do you want? Just so you know that you have made it. You have reached hyperspace. You'll be up against Gore after no time. Oh, really? Well, how far away is this Gore then? Gore isn't too far away. It's just nearby. You hear that, guys? We're not too far away now. Oh, thank Christ for that! Rumble! Rumble! You're gone. Wally, is there a problem? Not yet. Anomaly detected outside, uh... Hey, fellas, you might want to look at this. Is that a black hole? Maybe that's what Wally is talking about. Hey, Makuma, we found a black hole. Is that what you think is Goraf? Hey, Kimmy! Goraf is in a black hole, it's a Death Star, I'm still Dugan! Look, well what I would like to know would be, can you survive a black hole? Or does it kill you? Well, from what I've heard, scientists often do tests with lab rats. Well, we don't have any lab rats or guinea pigs. But we do, however, have two mammals. A horse and a monkey. Well, who are we gonna send out? Well, have no fear, my friends. Because I, Godzilla, King of the Monsters, has a little coin with me. Now I'm going to flip this baby, and we'll see what the outcome will be. If it lands on the heads, we send Silver Hooves out, and if it lands on tails, then Sasquatch will be the guinea pig. Okay then, do it. Tails, you lose, Sasquatch. Oh, I don't want to go out there. It's too dangerous. Look, don't be a pussy primate, Sasquatch. You gotta do what the coin says. Alert, alert, anomaly has caught us and is now pulling us into its orbit. 
fall alive. I can't be up there. I am gonna die. I am gonna die. I don't want to die. Somebody please hold on to me. I am alone, you goddamn Gora. Everybody get on the ground now. God damn it, Gora, the dead animal. Oh, shut up, Wally. Alert, alert, enter the black hole. 95 pressure expected. Fall alert. Oh, oh shit. I can't stand no more. Oh, oh thank God that's over. Hey, somebody do me a favor and go check on the horse. Oh, I'll do it, lad. Hey, he's fine. He sucked through all that. Hey, hey, guys. Um, if the crisis is over, then why are the alarms still going? That's because it's yeah. That's because it's not yet over. We've yet to land on that dead planet that we're headed towards. We're not landing. We're crashing. Ah! We crash. Wow. Ah! No one hear us. Oh. Ah! Oh no, we've lost two of our Monster Island buddies! Oh, oh, oh. 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 Hey, Varen. Is that you? Yeah, I'm not sure, Ankyrus. Uh, did we die? I don't think so. Uh, uh, Varen, look. Oh no. Oh, friends. What's that strange sound? I don't believe it. Gorath got our monster heroes. Dugan.